guys so welcome back to my youtube channel my name is alif and today tutorial video is how to make a vertical video for instagram uh, story igtv or uh, basically a vertical video for um, social media uh, content posting i'll say so i've made a tutorial on how to make vertical videos with Vegas pro but it's a bit clunky and outdated for that tutorial and this tutorial uh, is the updated versions all right so I have a video here in my timeline it's a 16 by 9 and it's pre-rendered video you can natively edit based on your main projects or export the video first then you um, basically do uh, re-edit the video in such way in a new in a new project file as a vertical video you can do any um, way you want to but for the sake of the tutorial i'm just gonna re-edit this pre-rendered video um, but if you do such way you will lose quality but in my opinion quality is not a thing for a vertical video because you're most likely gonna post it on instagram so um first of all you just you you want to change the project into a vertical ratios simply click the project properties and all you need to do is just flip the value between width and height so the width will be 1080 and the height will be 1920 which is a 9 by 16 aspect ratio which i already made a template here called insta story press apply and now we are in vertical ratios now there's a three types of vertical video one is a full frame one is such uh like this one like top middle and bottom kind of uh, instagram story here uh, or a sideways kind of um, vertical videos so i'm just gonna duplicate this video real quick and put a marker so this is full frame all right i'm just gonna label it so you can see this is um, tree videos and this one would be a uh, sideway all right so the full frame so if you want to make this video fulfill the entire frame just simply go to the pen and crop go to the very first keyframe of the positions right click and match the output i expect and you're pretty much done that's it pretty simple all right and if let's just say your subject or whatever is not in the center you can just animate the keyframe so it move uh, in a timeline of the keyframe positions here all right next one here is the tree view whereby you got the top middle and the bottom video so i'm just going to bring it down and duplicate this track real quick so i'm just going to label this top this one middle so you guys can see properly this one bottom all right so uh, instead of playing around with the um, pan and crop, you want to basically use the track motion, which is kind of similar, but it's for the layer. Um, so we are editing the top uh, layer here. So uh, you want to basically move this up. So I already make a sort of a template. I just press top, it'll bring the video on the top. Uh, basically, you want to put the value for the Y, which is the position at 657 and for the bottom one click this one you just invert the value for the y by adding a negative which is already uh, done that so uh, the y position will be negative 657 pixels so we got the video on the top middle and the bottom all right and then the last one sideways which the video is uh, rotated in sideways and fulfill entire frame uh, let me just bring this to the new track all right uh, just again go to the layer track motion and the angle you can put 90 degrees uh, for uh, I would say right side or put negative if you want to put on the left side up to you uh, but for the width you want to change it to 1920 so it will fulfill the entire frame and again the angle you just either add negative or remove the negative to uh, flip the video either left to right so that's how you make this three type of um, vertical videos with vegas pro now 
this is how you make this tree version of the vertical videos regardless what version you do all of the export settings are the same so you go to file uh, render s and you can pick any uh, formats you want but most likely this video is going to end up on instagram you want to pick the magix avc which is h264 kodak and I already have my custom template here which is instagram sorry so what i did with the custom templates here is uh the frame size you just want to invert the width and the height it's pretty much similar uh to the project properties so uh the width which is 1080 and the height 1920. so once you invert the value here might as well save it as a template and pretty much render a video so your video will be exported in vertical formats so that's how you do a vertical video with vegas pro and uh, if you have any question related you can just leave it on a comment section and see you guys next time bye bye